G'day. We went for a bit of a walk on the beach the other day and we found a number of these Port Jackson shark eggs. Now legend has it that mermaids would pick up shark eggs and use them for their purses. So often people will call a shark egg, I think any shark egg, a mermaid's purse. I would say the babies have hatched out and gone away. I'm not sure which end they come out of. It's a bit hard to tell. Interesting shape, but I guess they wouldn't be too appealing to a predator with some of these spiky bits. And I guess would look just like kelp. So they've got a better chance of survival. There was plenty of these on the beach. So I'm going to cut it open and see what's inside. It might just have a baby shark in it. Baby shark. Do, 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 baby shark. Here we go, not sure where to start. Now inside this shark egg is really quite spectacular. It's a really leathery, smooth surface in there. And can you see how shiny and, uh, and patterned that is in there? It's really quite dramatic. It reminds me a little bit maybe of an oyster. Quite safe and protected you'd think for a Port Jackson baby shark to spend the first part of its life. So after doing a little bit of research, I found that most sharks do lay their eggs, but many give birth to their babies alive. This is the Port Jackson shark egg, and this is what it might look like just as it was going to hatch. That is a picture of a Port Jackson shark. That's what they would look like. Not terribly big. But that is a front-on one, a cute little face. Um, and they have this interesting thing where they'll pick the eggs up and take them to a rock crevice or something and plant them in a safe place. Also found this nurse shark, which fascinatingly, inside the mother's womb, the baby sharks eat each other until there's only one left quite often, and it hatches out as the victor.